Well, as I had hoped for a week ago, there is a new firmware version that's been released. Of course, I was looking for a new beta release of the 4.2.2, and what we got instead was a, a new, uh, I don't know, maybe it's the final release for the 4.1.1. So I flashed my tablet, and let's take a look at what uh, the new 4.1.1 uh, 0428 release looks like. Okay, here we are at the home screen. Again, this is 4.1.1, the 0428 release of the firmware. Um, it seems to be pretty responsive as compared to uh, previous versions. Now let's take a look at uh, a few apps. Let's start with browsers. So this is a Dolphin browser and overall I've used the Dolphin browser on several versions of firmware and it seems to be just a little more uh, snappy, a little snappier performance than uh, Chrome browser. The good news is that, is that now the Chrome browser does work where it, it, uh, it was broken in some of the uh, other versions of firmware that I had uh, flashed my tablet with. So this is the Dolphin browser. This is kind of my backup, my fallback when I'm having problems with Chrome or Chrome won't work, I'll go to the Dolphin browser. And here we are with the Chrome browser. I mean, it's good to see that it is finally working again. I've lost track of what uh, some of the previous firmware versions uh, break it and then it works again, then it's broken. So for now, on the 4.1.1, 0428 release Chrome browser does work again although it may be a little sluggish compared to uh, the Dolphin browser and now next up let's take a look at uh, Netflix because Netflix was broken in uh, the previous two versions of firmware I had on my tablet I think those may have been 4.2.2 uh, releases it seemed to break the uh, Netflix app and now it's good to see that it's back and working just fine so let's take a look at uh, a couple of, a couple of clips from a couple of different movies uh, first up is going to be Rango let's just take a look at uh, again overall the 4.1.10428 release seems to be uh, a good performer Let's jump ahead a little bit. So it'll be interesting to see what what the next release we do see. Since uh, I mean, the good thing is that I know is not uh, just sitting still. They are working to make these tablets better, and. Uh, that's a plus. I mean there are other tablets out there that may have, haven't had any firmware updates and the fact that I know is not only working to make the 4.1.1 better at the same time as they're working on the 4.2.2 release is just a good sign. Okay, that's enough of that. Let's drop back out and see what's next. If you don't update your apps on a regular basis, you may have missed that there's a new version of the Play Store. And uh, I really like the way it looks and performs. So this is the new look of the new Play Store. Uh, off the top of my head, I don't remember what version it is, but uh, if you just go ahead and, and update your Play Store app, uh, this is what it's going to look like. 
Uh, to me, it's just a little easier to uh, find what you're looking for and to identify what you're seeing. Icons are a lot larger. So that's that's all I have for today. Um, just want to show you the new Play Store and. We'll see if uh, what's next on the horizon for the Ino Noble 7 Venus tablet. Uh, at this rate, I'm pretty satisfied. So, enjoy.